Hello, so today I'm looking at a DIY UI charging device that I've made. Um, it's nothing special really, I mean it cost me a total of um, around oh, three pounds, something to that effect. Not pretty, it's got um, I was going to use it in the office, but as you can see the circuit here is still well and truly exposed. So yeah, this isn't something I'd really want to use in the office, but at home it's perfectly fine. See the red light plugged in, and then when you connect the device of your choosing to the little sucker there, the light goes blue, and the phone charges. See who? Google stops sending me WhatsApps. There we go. So I'm just going to take this device apart, and I'll show you the different pieces per spade. Now, what well, all I needed to buy really was a um, you can see you could a numerous amount of charging pads you could buy. Um, some more expenses than others, um, and I guess the only other thing I had. So I had a little look around there. There's a few things you could potentially use. Um, this is expensive. It is really um, eight pounds. You could just buy a whole freaking QI uh, system for that. This, oh my goodness, um, I, I think this would be a bit of a pain. You wouldn't. There's no way you could deconstruct this to fit the QI thing in. But but if you had something like this, just you know, a simple. Um, I think you could use the adhesive tape that you usually get on the back of these to mount the coil here. Um, you could play around with it, yeah, and the phone would sit on the on this. You could play around with it, and it it would work. I imagine. So, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to dismantle the device and just show how you put this together, and then, uh, yeah. So what we have here, there away some of these. Yeah. Is what you would usually get in. You'd usually just get the circuit here, which uh, in this instance is got one USB uh, there, another micro micro USB on the actual circuit board itself, and you get the coil. The charge which your phone would detect um, usually somewhere somewhere in the back, maybe maybe there on this phone. And um, what I noticed is with uh, this one when I was looking on the website is the the center of the uh, ring. There's there's no need there's no need for any any to be here. So I figured, hey, I could just chisel this out, which is what I did. <laughs> I literally just used a small screwdriver <laughs> and a big hammer, hammer, and just smashed a few holes in it. Now, of course, I cracked the outside a little bit, but we don't we don't really care about this because in this instance, I was I already had this little suction holder. I knew that you know I, if I made just the big enough hole, it would fit through, and then the phone would stick on, and everything would. So yeah, when you actually get one of these, it's, this is kind of a ceramic uh, material, although it kind of looked almost like it could have had some sort of grain on it, but it, no, it's some kind of plasticky ceramic -y material. Um, so I've just uh, stuck some electrical tape on the back here. You can just see the relief of the, um, that would have been the adhesive pad that I, you would use on an device. So, you know, if you happen to find yourself some kind of, like this, where you could take the screws out on one side, um, all there, which you do have one like this, when you've got all this together, it's quite large, so it's very easy to knock that out. There we have it, one DIY UI charger. So, if we were to put this all back in now. Be careful with this. You could, I guess, this either or of the cables if you really wanted to, just obviously, with all this open surgery, just it'll be silly and actually just. Switch the uh, services. So now, where it becomes difficult. Right, so we have light. We have right. So phone goes here. Phone charges. Bingo. So yeah, nice and easy. I mean. 
It's just a nice fun to play around with. I mean, realistically, for five pounds, five dollars, whatever you whatever you're paying, wherever you are, you could just buy a QI enabled dock right off the bat from eBay, I imagine. Um, but you know what's the fun in that when you can uh, play around yourself? But yeah, so you could you could spend five dollars on eBay, I imagine, and easily buy yourself a little charging plate, but you know, these these things are quite cool. You could, you know, think of the imagine, amount of things that you could put one of these in, hidden away somewhere just on the edge of your uh, nightstand. Any, all sorts of things. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hopefully that was enjoyable. Cheers.